Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So overnight in my region, Microsoft has rolled out this week's new pair of beta channel insider preview builds, builds 22621 and 22624.1616. And just a quick recap regarding the beta channel. The beta channel build 22624 has new features rolling out and build 22621, the new features are off by default. And something else just to take note of, as I have mentioned previously, Microsoft does say the beta channel is the place where they preview experiences that are closer to what they will ship to their general customers. And this does not mean, though, that every feature they try out in the beta channel will ship. So always always take note of that when we talk about features in the beta channel. Now, this week, there's actually not too much going on in the beta channel. But this is also a good indication, though, that things are starting to stabilize for the next Moment 3 update, which, as I have posted previously, we can expect to see start rolling out at the end of May next month, moving into the beginning of June of this year, 2023. And that's because, as posted previously, um, some of the features being tested in the beta channel, um, we can expect to see roll out with the third wave of new features with Moment 3 shortly. Now, even though there's not too much going on this week, um, just to make a couple of quick mentions, uh, because we do like to keep you posted and informed. And uh, if you are in the beta channel, um, an accessibility live captions improvement has rolled out for build 22624, and the language support has now been expanded uh, to include Danish, English Ireland, French Canada, Korean and Portuguese Portugal. And another improvement and fix for build 22624 is regarding um, the new setting on the Windows Update page if you are in the beta channel, which will appear more or less in this region on the Windows Update page for getting the latest updates as soon as they are available, which Microsoft did introduce in a previous uh, beta channel build, which now um, offers a Windows configuration update that's offered via Windows Update for insiders on build 2264, which Microsoft says is designed to help make sure uh, this new toggle is connected to their back-end services correctly. And then just another quick mention about an important fix. Uh, they fixed an issue which was causing a noticeable increase in the explorer.exe. Now, explorer.exe explorer is basically uh, the process which is um, uh, responsible for your start menu, your taskbar, your file explorer, and so on. So basically, it's the shell of your Windows operating system. So that um, um, has a fix that was causing crashes in the last flight for some insiders. So that's quite an important fix that has rolled out. And then over and above that, there are input fixes, um, live caption fixes, and accessibility fixes. And then there's also known issues because obviously this is a preview build, so we do get known issues. Uh, there's known issues for search on the taskbar, the file explorer, and live captions. And um, I'll leave a link to the release notes uh, for these latest builds, 2261 and 22624.1616 in the description if you are interested. And um, these builds were updated with the update KB5025308. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.